is a gentleman, Baldy. How are you? I am happy to meet you today. And uh, uh, given the constraints of time, uh, we cannot discuss much, but that we've come together and the discussions will continue. Bobby, you've been clearing up. And what you met today, because the first time you're meeting him on a one-to-one -one basis, officially at least, what, what, what is the impression of him? Well, maybe I could have asked him that question too. That yeah, I'll ask him, I'll the, ask him the, the question you have. been hearing of and meeting Fundi today. Yes. What's his opinion? <laughs> I see the Fundi that they painted. But I think that uh, uh, we're all relaxed and uh, we discussed frankly uh, from the heart. And uh, he appreciated that. And, uh, he still re-emphasized what uh, he said all over Fran uh, France 24, that um, he had sent somebody, but I said I was meeting with him in Bookmaker, which uh, I never got this information, so I had to clarify that. But nonetheless, uh, he had to bring up the issues of a lack and Born in the English-speaking region of Cameroon on July 7, 1941, in Hamenda, in the country's northwest, Frundi ran against Bia three times in the presidential elections of 1992, 2004, and 2011. John Flundy, one of the historic opponents of Cameroon's long-time ruling president, Paul Bia, has died. Flu died late Monday evening in Yaoundé at the age of 81 following a long illness. According to his party, the Social Democratic Front, he was the founder and the president of the party. He created in 1990 the main opposition represented in the Cameroon National Assembly. Born in the English-speaking region of Cameroon, in recent months, reports of his critical state of health had been circulating. He was said to have undergone surgery in a Swiss hospital, but after several months, abroad returned to Cameroon. In his absence, he handed over the presidency of his party to his vice president, Joshua Osi. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.